Hey, I'm Adrian Meadows, AKA To Aspire, and I'm a graphic designer and hand lettering artist. My name is Frankie Page, AKA Frankie Zombie, and I am a muralist, abstract artist, slash designer. Hi, I'm Michael Webster, and I'm an assistant professor of sculpture at Wofford College. So I found this project exciting because it's the first big public project I've done in Spartanburg, and I really value an interaction with the local community through my artwork, and I really value that, that connection to the, the city. And so this is the first project I've been able to do here, and it's exciting to start to build more connections with the city and to hopefully add something that people find valuable. Uh, the crosswalk as a device in space is very rigid and very straight and repetitive and I wanted to break up that repetition. I wanted to make the shapes become a little bit more organic and add something that, that differentiated itself from the landscape of the city. Being so used to seeing just like straight white lines, when you see something different, naturally you're going to slow down and say, what is that? And hopefully that will influence a lot more safety between drivers and pedestrians. Yeah. Whenever people see the crosswalk here in Spartanburg, I want them to see something that's playful, something that's interactive, something that makes them see something new in the existing space of the city and to see something as colorful and vibrant and tells them that uh, that's a reflection of what the city is here. It might tie into inspiration a bit, but uh, it literally came from watching the Jetsons growing up. Uh, the colors, the patterns, the, the shapes, the monochromatic uh, uh, shades, uh, it all came from the, the cartoon growing up. Watching cartoons growing up was like a major thing, especially for our era. Yeah. And two, the Jetsons like gave us a feel of everything we thought was just like a cool dream at the time. And you know, once you grew up, you start to see all these things that was in the cartoon take place. Your dreams and things you want to do in life aren't so concrete just yet. You can be the one to make that change and make it the future. Or make the future become present. Yeah. Yeah. It's exciting having your work be part of the landscape that people see whenever they come to the city. And as people walk through the city, that they'll understand that uh, public art is a major component of what we have here in Spartanburg. I think artists always want to have their work seen by a lot of people, and that's always the goal. So it's exciting to have something that's going to be here, part of uh, the local community. So to be grown and creative and uh, within your profession uh, at, as an adult and just be able to walk by every day and say wow I, I did that yeah. or have family members you know walk by family and friends say no my baby did this and I, it's, it's a cool thing man you know. Yeah. The kind of art I saw was just like you know Charleston swamps or you know, landscapes and stuff like that. So to see public art by people, not only of, you know, my stature or my generation, seeing it possible beyond what's like the quote unquote normal or like, yeah, traditional art is, is important, you know? Cause you can't, you can't be it if you can't see it, you know? Spartanburg, what I've noticed from my two years here, Spartanburg has a lot of personal investment in the arts here. People are really invested in trying to make Spartanburg a richer artistic community and they put a lot of themselves into that process. Since I've been back home in Spartanburg, uh, it's definitely growing. You see, you know, all races, all colors, all creeds, everyone is coming together to, to just create and do what they love. Yeah, I like to say that, you know, even though we're grateful for this opportunity, you know, um, that's provided us to bring art to downtown. I think at the end of the day, everyone just needs to realize that it's bigger than us. Just speaking on community again, we need each other to support each other, to uplift each other, because we're only as strong as our community is. Mm -hmm. And if we have a strong community, it can go a lot of places. We can get known for a lot of things together. Keep Spartanburg on the map and then push it to greater heights as well.